Heading to Ogles County now. And while Waynesfield Goshen struggled last week at home against Delphish Jefferson, the Tigers' opponent tonight, Harden Northern, picked up their first win since 2011, beating St. Wendell in 44-6. Polar Bears trying to post back-to-back -back wins for the first time since a four-game winning streak took place for the school in 2007. Bears, all business. Tigers trying to get their first win. And take a look at this. First play from scrimmage. Lake Turner keeps it helmet to helmet. Packs on 15 yards. Balls to 33. Next play, Brandon Turner turns it on. And he is gone. 67 yards for the touchdown. It's 6-0 Tigers. Extra point was wide. Bears Wes Slaughter on the kick return. Gets a good return out to the 26. Had such a big day as the running back. Last week, second and 10, Schlatter does a nice job to shed one tackle, but not the rest of those Tiger defenders, four yard loss. How about the Waynesfield Goshen secondary? Seth Fuller getting in the passing lane and knocking this one away, forcing a punt. On that kick, Turner picks up the grounder, and he gets it to the 38 yard line. The golfer yelling four, and handing off to five. Josh Searson, five yards as Colton Garman brings him down. Fourth and seven, they're going for it. Searson again, great run. Lower in the boom, first down, but a holding penalty. Does back it up to the 25, still enough yardage for a first. A couple plays later, it is Shane Tate punching it in from 13 yards out. Waynesfield Goshen gets the victory tonight. 49 to nothing, the final from Ogblaze County.